911, what is your emergency? I hear shots! Okay, ma'am, calm down. What kind of shots? <laughs> Welcome to a thrilling journey through some of the most iconic movie cars ever sold. <laughs> we begin our list with the Lotus Esprit S1 from The Spy Who Loved Me, famously driven by James Bond himself. Portrayed by Roger Moore. Sold for $997,000, it found a new home with tech mogul Elon Musk, who cherishes its cinematic history. Next up, we have the 1967 Ford Mustang from Gone in 60 Seconds, famously driven by Nicolas Cage in the adrenaline-pumping heist film. This iconic muscle car, known as Eleanor, fetched $1 million at auction, and was acquired by a dedicated enthusiast who appreciates its legendary status on and off the screen. Moving along, we come to the 1929 Dusenberg Model J Murphy SWB convertible coupe from the Gay Divorcee, a classic Hollywood gem driven by Fred Astaire. Sold for $2.37 million, it now resides in the collection of Robert Perry, appreciating its timeless elegance and silver screen pedigree. Our next entry is the 1955 Ferrari 750 Monza Spider from Don the Beach driven by the legendary Fred Astaire in the apocalyptic drama. This stunning Ferrari, sold for $2.53 million, was acquired by an anonymous buyer, drawn to its graceful lines and Hollywood heritage. Now, let's rev our engines for the 1968 Ford Mustang GT390 from Bullet, immortalized by Steve McQueen's thrilling chase through the streets of San Francisco. This iconic pony car, sold for $3.71 million, acquired by Sean Kiernan. Its connection to one of cinema's most legendary car chases lives on. Next up, the legendary 1966 Batmobile from the iconic Batman TV series, a symbol of justice and ingenuity. With its sleek design and crime-fighting gadgets, this Batmobile soared to new heights, having been the sole property of George Berris was eventually sold at a collector car auction for an impressive $4.6 million. Its new owner remains undisclosed, but the Batmobile's legacy continues to captivate fans and enthusiasts alike. And last, but certainly not least, we have the timeless 1961 Ferrari 250 GT SWB California Spider, a true masterpiece famously featured in the 1986 movie A Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Driven by actor Matthew Broderick in the film, this iconic car stole the show with its elegance and performance. Sold for a jaw-dropping $17,160,000, this Ferrari epitomizes luxury and style, making it the crown jewel of any car collection. It was acquired by UK media personality Chris Evans, solidifying its status as the crown jewel of any car collection. Thanks for joining us on this cinematic journey. From Bond's Lotus Esprit to Ferris Bueller's Ferrari, these vehicles have left an unforgettable mark. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more thrilling content. Drive safe, and we'll see you next time.